Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna show you this homemade electric flying slaughter taser I made yesterday. So you can see that there's duct tape wrapped around it, and that is to cover up the the gap that would have been there from the racket itself. There's also glue to seal it up and the wires and everything, and there's the prongs. You're not big at all, of course, you know. I had to make them small so that this would work the way it should. And there's a piece of rubber in there to act as an insulator, and it allows it to spark bigger. So I put it there, and I glued it with super glue. And, of course, to do that, to hook it up, I disconnected the wires from the racket and used some connectors on it as the prongs. And so it's made from a Zap Master handheld bug zapper racket. And it's it's kind of hard to read if you can read that output volt it says 2750 so you can imagine that's a little painful but, you know I wouldn't recommend it as a taser because it's it's not going to do anything really but you know it still has the light and it still works like it would you just you push in that button and that's how it sparks. So I'm going to give you a test run here. Let's show you what it's like. And turn off the lights so you can see it. And so here we go. It's kind of how fast it can go. Of course, I can adjust it by bending the prongs very slightly. So but I wanted to get it so that it would be fast and loud so that would scare off anything, you know, on the table.